In this lesson, we're going to talk about how to add an image to your web page. If you're one of our clients, every, every single web page will have a menu at the bottom. The first step is to log in. You do that by clicking this admin link at the bottom of your page. You'll be prompted for a username and password. You should have been emailed one when you signed up with us. Enter it. Click login. The first step in adding an image is to go to the images menu item here and click on it and upload the image to your website. Once you're on this page here, you click this browse button, find your image on your computer, and don't forget to click this upload button once you find that image. That will bring you to this page. At this point, you can categorize your image. This just helps you later on to keep track of things. And once you're done with your changes, you save it. Now, we've only uploaded our image to the server. We have not added it to that web page. So that's the next step. The easiest way to do that is to use this link here. It says View Site to go back to our site and navigate to the page we want to edit. And now that we've logged in, when we click this Edit Page link, at the bottom of our page, we're presented with some edit menus below each editable section of our web, of our web page. In this case, let's add the image here. So we'll use this Edit link. And we're logged in, so it should go right to the editor. And here's the editor. Now here, we can do a number of things, including add the image using these controls up here. So we'll just move our cursor where we want the image to be. And here's the image, insert image control. Click that. Now we want to find the image we just uploaded. We could fil sort of scroll through all these images and figure it out that way, or we could further filter it by category, which is what we're going to do here. We put it in the gallery, well, put it in the headers category, I think. Or maybe we put it in the gallery. So let's look in the gallery. There it is. We can add a description. And when we're done, we insert it. Click that insert button. Once it's in here, we can further format it by centering it, or we could uh, link it. Here's a link control. Um, we'll center it here. And once we're done with our changes, we click the save button the bottom right. And finally, we just want to look at the page, the live page, to make sure it looks right. So we look at the, um, we look for the view site link at the top right here, and click that, and just navigate to the page we just tried to edit. Our changes are there; they look like they're supposed to look, and that concludes our lesson.